Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be about rags and why I use them and how I wash them and I guess kind of how I use them as well and um, how I wash my towels to go along with that. So today's video is going to be about the rags that I use for cleaning. A lot of you had asked me in some of my cleaning videos about the rags, um, how I wash them and things like that. So I just thought I would make a video kind of going over all of that. So I really didn't know that using rags was kind of um, not the thing, I guess, until it kind of was brought up in my comments. A lot of people were saying, hey, you use rags, you know, what? what's that? I kind of started to look back at some of the cleaning videos that I like to watch and I realized that they don't really use rags either and I never really thought about it until you guys brought it up. So I was just raised using rags, my mom used rags and I've always used rags so I never really thought anything about it. I like to use rags because I feel like they get a deeper clean and they're obviously cheaper than purchasing um, paper towels. So that's why I use them basically just because I was grown, you know, I was raised that way and because I like the way that they clean. So I use rags to clean in my kitchen countertops, the table, bathrooms, pretty much everything. So I have rags that are just dedicated for cleaning, obviously, and then we have washcloths that we use in the shower. So I have a basket in the laundry room that is for the rags, and once they are done being used, they go directly into that basket. So they are never in contact with any of our other clothes. They just go straight to that basket, especially after I clean the bathroom. The one that I use in the kitchen gets replaced every day, so I will either get a new one in the morning or well, I pretty much get one every morning, so either that evening it will go into the laundry rag or the next morning when I replace it, it will go into the laundry, um, in the rag bin in the laundry room. So, so all of my rags have just retired into being a rag. They started as a washcloth at some point in their life and they ended up as a rag. I've not gone out and just purchased them for the sole purpose of cleaning. They've just ended up being a rag. They've gotten stained or bleached or they were just old and yucky, so they became a rag. I have purchased some of the microfiber cloths at like the Dollar Tree that I use on mirrors and things like that or for dusting, but other than that, all of the rags I have are just old washcloths. So if you have any questions that I don't that I don't go over in this video, definitely let me know in the comments below. So I'm just going to show you guys how I wash the rags and how I also wash our towels and washcloths just because that has always been kind of a challenge for me is getting the smell out of towels and rags. It seems impossible, at least for me. There's always that, I don't know if it's like a mildewy smell or what it is, but no matter how hot the water or what I do, they just kind of have that smell. So like I will wash my towels, they'll be freshly folded, I'll go take a shower, I take a fresh towel, and it smells. And I don't know why that is. I've noticed it when we went to people's homes before and we were guests and I was using their towels that they had the same problem. So I know I'm not the only one, but I have finally found the solution for that. So I definitely wanted to share with you what I use and it also works for my rags as well. So if you want to see how I wash them, then just keep watching. All right, so here are the products that I use. I use the Gain Original, the Gain Fireworks Original, and the Suavitel. And then my secret ingredient is this Odor Cleanse Laundry Additive. It is actually made with all natural ingredients and it is awesome. I've been using it for the last several weeks and it has truly helped me with getting that smell out of my towels and my rags and I will keep repurchasing it. I do have a coupon code for you guys for 15% off in the description box if you are interested. So definitely check it out give it a try because I have absolutely been loving it. So I'm just measuring out everything and you're just gonna take the odor cleanse and shake it up really well and follow the directions on the back of the bottle. They are, or it is totally safe for HE washers and front loader, top loader, all of that. There may be a little bit different instructions for if you have a front loading washing machine. I've never owned a front loader, so I'm not really sure how that works, but I do remember reading specific instructions for if you did have a front loader. So just in case you were wondering, it is fine for that kind of washer. I just have this top loader kind and I just add it in with the laundry detergent and it works just fine that way. But you don't wanna use anything like vinegar or bleach or anything like that. It works perfectly fine on its own. So I just add it in with my normal stuff 
and let it do its job and it works great. So yeah. So on my washer, I, hack, I actually have a setting for towels, so I just set it to that, and then you're going to want to use either hot or warm water when using that odor cleanse. So I just set it to hot, and I have um, fabric softener, and then I always do an extra rinse as well. It does say in the instructions to use an extra rinse if you have that option. I don't think that it would necessarily be a bad thing if you didn't, but it does say that in the instructions, so I get it, go ahead and do it. And really quickly there, I was just showing you, that's the little basket that I keep my rags in. I'm doing a load of towels there, and then I'm going to move on to my gross rags. So there they are. And I'm gonna just dump them all in and I do pretty much the same thing except I do not use the gain scent beads or the fabric softener I basically just want to get these suckers really clean I don't really care if they smell nice I just don't want them to stink and I want them to be clean so I'm gonna wash them on a hot setting again and I believe I use the white setting on my washer it really doesn't matter just make sure you wash them in the hottest water you possibly can on a heavy cycle or at least a normal cycle and then if you can go ahead and do an extra rinse if not it shouldn't really make a difference but that's just how I do mine so I'm just showing you here I actually have a setting for whites and I'm gonna turn it over to that and then I'm gonna go ahead and set everything else up it already put it on hot for me and heavy and extra rinse actually so it made it easy and I was thinking I had fabric softener because I normally do but I didn't so that's it I'm just gonna let that wash and then when they're done I'll just go ahead and toss them in the dryer like normal and they're done. All right guys, so I am done doing the towels and the rags. The rags are actually in there washing now and when they're done, I'll just throw them in the dryer. That's the whole process, that's how I do it. It's really simple and it works when I get these towels out of the dryer. I can guarantee you when I smell them, they're gonna just smell so fresh. They do smell a little less like laundered than our regular laundry, usually smells really good and like the gain that I use. And the towels and the rags just smell super fresh and clean if that makes sense so they do they don't smell as much like perfumey as the laundry detergent has the fragrance in it they just smell really fresh and clean and I don't know what I did before this stuff because this stuff will definitely be a staple item in my laundry room. I have a coupon code for you guys in the description box to get 15% off if you do want to try this. And also their website, they have a ton of other um, odor removing products that you should check out. To name a few, they have some pet crystals that you can put when your pet has an accident in the carpet. I know I talked a little bit about that in my pet um, or in my puppy potty training video on how to get rid of the odor. Well, they actually have a product for that. They have a hand soap to get rid of odors on your hands, which I actually have. And my husband uses it for when he is working on cars a lot. And sometimes he will get diesel fuel or gasoline on his hands. And just washing your hands with regular soap does not really get rid of that smell so it's nice to have that but yeah they have a lot of different products so you should definitely go over and check out the website if you're interested but definitely at least give this stuff a try because I'm telling you I really think that you will like it I'm gonna be using it so if that says anything because I'm really particular about my laundry you know that if you've been watching me for a while I want my laundry to smell good so yeah Anyways, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.